Hi guys, how are you? This is Lloyd's. Welcome back to my channel. This is the Canadian Lifestyles for New Immigrants. As I promised you last time, I will be showing you, you know, life in Canada, the Canadian lifestyle, and especially for newcomers who are, you know, they're curious to know the kind of life to expect, uh, potential immigrants who are thinking of immigrating, but then they don't know whether they're coming to a dump, you know. So I sought out to show you real life in Canada. And this is real life in Calgary, Alberta. Okay, so today I want to show you a one bedroom condo apartment. Okay, last time I showed you a beautiful cozy basement suite. So basements are underground, okay, under the main house. But then as you know, apartments, they are above ground. Uh, this one is somewhere on third floor. Uh, so we're going to see what this comes up with, uh, what is uh, provided, uh, how much it costs, the space, and you know, the Canadian lifestyle. Anyway, have you subscribed? If you haven't, please do subscribe and like this video and share this video, okay? So I think what I will do, uh, let me first give you a background. So you're going to find that uh, apartments here, most of them, they are called apartment condos. Uh, so you don't do the maintenance of apartment condos. You pay a condo fee that takes care of your utilities, majority of the utilities, that is heating, water, and electricity. Uh, you don't shovel snow, you don't manicure the lawns, you don't do any of that. That's why you pay that condo fee. Okay, of course, then you have to abide by the bylaws uh, because these condos come with a lot of bylaws like, you know, noise control, how many people can live here, uh, stuff like that, which ensures that these condos are really good. They are clean all the time. They are well taken care of. Okay, so this little condo is about 680 square feet. Okay, it comes with one dedicated parking spot, underground heated parking spot. That's for you, whether you're buying it or whether you're renting it, that is your, that is your parking spot. And it has an elevator. I'm not going to show you the exterior of this building, uh, but I will show you right from the elevator a little bit. And then we come in and I take you into a small tour. Are you ready? Okay, let's go. Let's go guys. Uh, Ignore the kitchen. We are going to come back to this kitchen. I just want to take you outside for a minute. So bear with me. So that's the outside of the condo. That's the corridor to the various uh, suites. And then right on the right side there, straight, that's the elevator. You come straight like this and you get into your condo, okay? All right, once you enter this little place, you will notice that it's an open style, you know? It's open style, majority of the homes here are open style. So you're in the kitchen, you're in the dining, and you're in the living space. Uh, so on the right here, you will see this little kitchen uh, right ahead. That's the living space. Uh, then we shall come to the left, onto my left. You will see the bathroom, uh, the washer and dryer and a closet. Don't worry. We are going to see that uh, once we go around. Okay. All right. Once you come in, you hang your jacket there and your bag. The things you take on the go, right? And now we go to this kitchen. Lots of space for a kitchen. Um, this is the dishwasher. Yep. And the sink, the double sink is here. Remember the other one that I showed you? Same thing. Uh, double sink, hot and cold water. Okay. And these tabs, they are extendable. Um, and then you can see the well done countertops, very uh, nicely finished countertops and your stove is right there and your microwave right there. Lots of storage, lots and lots and lots of storage. This place packs in a lot of storage. You'll not believe it for your utensils, uh, for whatever it is that you have. 
uh, storage 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 is key uh, these are extra cabinets and drawers um, and then you'll see here we have a little island okay a little island that still packs more space so you know you spoil for choice on whatever you want to store there's so much uh, storage space here and then uh, right there what we see that is a work desk you know these days you have to work from home this one this suite actually came ready for working from home so it has your little desk you can always sit there and work okay uh, and you have the fridge right there and the pantry yes it's tiny it doesn't come with a walk-in pantry but guess what you still have your pantry it's a one bedroom so uh you know you this place is meant for a family uh, of two or at most uh, a couple and a kid so that is enough pantry right there uh as you see here this is the little dining area yes <laughs> You sit there and you eat, you have your dinner, and you can relax there in the living room, okay? As you watch your TV, that's a nice little cozy place uh, to sit and relax and rewind after a long day. Uh, you see the windows, big windows, a lot of lighting. Uh, this is evening, it's evening time, so there isn't a lot of sunshine. And then you'll see this, this door right here. Uh, a big door also that leads you to the patio okay that's your patio right there so there goes your patio uh, you can sit there over summer time you can relax with your friends uh, you can even barbecue right and you can see other condos out there right so let's go back uh, and I'll show you the other sections of this little nice place okay excuse me uh, right here we head into the bedroom okay but maybe before we go into the bedroom I just want to show you that you can regulate your heating in this area so this is the little place uh, where you have that heat uh, regulator you can set uh, just how warm or cold you want your apartment to be okay uh, the heating system that is the HVAC is uh, all around the suite on the exterior walls that's where you have uh, your heating coming through uh, you find that uh, majority of apartments and especially condos are very warm yes yeah, so in summertime uh, it can get really toasty okay so let's go into the bedroom uh, a very spacious bedroom as you will see really 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 spacious could even fit two beds uh, nice space here a lot of space and out there as we saw that is uh it's overlooking the patio again okay uh, so it's a nice place you can always see what's happening out there uh, a lot of air and big windows lovely lovely and as you can see the floor here are carpet okay that's the bedroom floors are carpet from the bedroom uh this suite i really love it because it comes with a walk-through closet, lots of closet space, lots and lots and lots as you can see. So if you're a couple, this can be a him and hers uh, closet uh, on both sides. So, you know, you can always fight it out on who, you know, who hangs their clothes where. All right. So you see that through this door, we are going now to the bathroom okay so you can walk right through the bedroom through the closet into your into your bathroom so let's see I'm gonna lock I'm just gonna close this door so that we see the little bathroom here it's not so big but I guess it's enough for one person or two so this is the little bathroom here uh, of course that's a sink there you know your your vanity there and uh, your bathtub where you can take your showers okay not so much of course but still this is enough space for a person or two so in this bathroom as we said you can go back to the bedroom straight or you can also go out it has two doors that door that goes into the closet and this door that goes back out where we started in the kitchen 
okay so here we are and we are back where we started this is the closet uh, most of the homes come uh, almost every house is gonna have this closet whereby you hang your outdoor jacket and keep your outdoor shoes okay so that's your little closet it's right by the entrance door and excuse me that's your washer and dryer okay your washer and dryer right there right so we are back to where we started guys so that is the quick tour of this little place i really love it i think it's cozy but then i think you should be the judge you should be able to judge and tell me what i find here in calgary that the homes are really nice um quality of life is good uh and this place okay yeah let me tell you how much would you get this place for if you're new it's always good to start small that's why i started with a basement so that you can see and of course they are cheaper basements than what i showed you last time i'm going to attach uh, that video into the description part of this video just so that you can compare so this is a good place to start if you're a couple or um, uh, just single or you have you're a couple with a young child actually what i didn't show you there is that couch you know that couch right there that is a couch bed so it actually opens up into a queen bed so you can always be able to host someone who is visiting town uh you know if you have that child uh, that's also a good place that your child can stay uh, can be sleeping while you guys figure out your life around this place okay so start at your own level i usually tell people new immigrants you choose your bills so you find that uh, the only thing you're going to be paying here uh, in this kind of a suite. So rent, if you're renting this place, you would rent it unfurnished for about uh, 1,000 Canadian dollars. If it's furnished, uh, you just walk through this place and settle, you can get it for about 1,200 Canadian dollars, but you will be paying a condo fee. A condo fee takes care of, uh, you know, the utilities and the maintenance, the exterior maintenance, okay? So the condo fee here is about 250. Some of them could be 300, okay? So that is, uh, and the other thing you have to pay also for this kind of an apartment, you have to pay for your own Wi-Fi okay uh, the basement was coming with everything inclusive because it's a basement this is a condo apartment so of course it's a little pricier but then again you pay for what you know you get what you pay for okay this is a lovely place i love it let you be the judge um if you are interested next week or the other week I am going to show you what you get uh, for a three bedroom house in this place. So assuming you're coming here as a bigger family, you want a bigger space to live in, I will show you what you will get and the kind of a life you'll be expecting uh, once you come here as a family. Again, did I tell you why I do this? I wanna give you, you know, <laughs> I wanna give you the visuals. I wanna show you the real life here so that even if you're just planning or thinking of immigrating, you know exactly what you're going to get in this place so have you subscribed my friend please if you haven't subscribed please do subscribe share like this video and take care i will see you next time